I was told to go back home to Jamaica by a black American man. What's up guys? Welcome back to my YouTube channel once again. My name is Dash Lifestyle. Kindly for watching me for the first time, remember to subscribe, like, share and also comment. To my returning subscriber, thank you so much for coming back and watching my video. Thank you so much for the love and support and greetings, greetings to my brothers and sister from all over from Caribbean countries. So thank you guys for tuning in and today we have this video whereby we have this uh, black Jamaican guy who was uh, in America. So this black guy, I don't know why blacks to blacks they are fighting because here we have black Jamaican but uh, right now he is staying in uh, United States and uh, he was doing a certain uh, comedy video to show uh, he was bathing with a soap and uh, according to this other black American uh, he saw that video he was telling this guy no this is not allowed here you should go back to your country go back to your slavery country this this black america i don't know why he's sounding rude and this is not what is supposed to happen so guys before uh diving to full conclusion uh to this video i want you guys to check this video then i will come back and explain more videos why black to black we are, we are fighting one another so guys check this video then i will come and explain more i was told to go back home to jamaica by a black american man and this is the reason why. So the other day I made a comedy sketch about Caribbean people seeing an American soap commercial for the first time. This is how it went. There's sleepy eyes. Morning's here. Time to come alive. Come on. Basically poking fun at the fact that we never see a washcloth in one of these uh, soap commercials. You're not going to see one because obviously they're advertising the soap. But some people didn't get the joke or they were offended because, hey, I'm not from America. And this is what somebody had to say. So I was told by this big tub of lard here, Omar Velos is dead on Instagram to stay out of America then. So I said, you sound like racist white folk. This man said, how can it be racism if we're all black? I'm just suggesting that y'all stay in your own country since America is so bad. Not once did I say America was bad, but let's continue. I said, you sound like one. Anyways, you displayed how fragile you are as a man with your response. White folks didn't even react the way you did. You just showed black immigrants how xenophobic some of our black American brothers and sisters are. This is a skit for Christ's sake. This is unbelievable, brother. So he replied to a comment that's up top that said, it's the other way around, sweetheart. Stop playing. Another person who's offended at this skit. Then he replied under that comment and said, they have the nerve to come here and judge us. They whole country still living like slaves. What? What? Excuse me? Huh? Then he told me I gotta keep those slave arms nice and tight. We were trading insults for insults, but he was more so on the racial side of things when I didn't bring up race at all. Not white or black. Chinese, Asian, whatever race is out there. Not once. I just said American. But this black gentleman here, who share the same color as I, said that I gotta keep my slave arms tight. Then he said, anyways, this was fun by Kunta Kinte. All racial and slave insults by someone that's black. You'd expect this from someone who's white, but no, that wasn't it. This individual right here hates black immigrants, and it's clear. Yeah, I'll continue to keep my slave arms tight, bro, instead of ending up with man boobs. But anyway, that's besides the point. It's so crazy how you as a black individual got the same ancestors that I got using slavery as an insult. That's wild. Man, it's just sad, man, that someone that looks like us is telling us to go back to our homes, sounding like racist white folks. You know, I've never been told by a white person to go back home to Jamaica. It happened twice. This is the second time in both incidents happened with someone who looked like me. So all black immigrants, I just want you to know that um, not all black Americans are like this individual here. Um, so don't treat your black brothers and sisters any different, but... This gentleman and people with his mindset are very dangerous. So guys, I hope you have seen that video and uh, this uh, black Jamaican, uh, he was saying that uh, he was doing a video, uh, it was a comedy video. And then this other black American guy jumped into this video and start 
uh, saying and start writing bad comments toward this guy. I don't know why this guy, uh, this black American is behaving this way, but uh, I hope it is not all black Americans they are doing this. You should not supposed to do this on black people, not only black people. I think we should respect each and everybody. No matter where you come from, whether you are black, whether you are white, you should respect uh, anyone who, everybody. And also, uh, because this guy is come, is not in his, uh, is not in his uh, land. Is not in his. Uh, is a migrant. He has come uh, there in the United States to work or maybe to study. Why are you sending her back to Jamaica? This is very bad and. Uh, that's why we are advocating for peace and unity. Black to black we should unite. This is now the message where Bob Marley, uh, he was saying, but the African unite, not only here in Africa we should unite, also you black people. You know you are representing Africa, outside Africa, and that's why we love to see our black. Uh, also Africa love black, black American, also Africa love uh, uh, Jamaica they are also black they are our brothers and sister I don't want uh, it is not good for them fighting each another each one of them fighting all, all over uh, uh, small issues yeah for me I can call it a small issues and I uh, don't try to send anybody home uh, because he's not in uh, his or her his own her country guys you can imagine uh, how it feels being sent away with someone you know, uh, you can imagine you are here in Africa and uh, you are a black and uh, the same same African is sending you back from your country. You can imagine. You are one color. Guys, one color and this guy is sending you back to your country. This is not good. This is not supposed to happen. And... Uh, I hope this guy he will correct his mistake and also I wish he could be he, he could be apologized to these other guys because uh, or what do you think guys you can also uh, write on the comment section you can give your thought to this uh, issue of this guy sending black imagine the same color black to other country we know you are a citizen of United States and also you are a black but I usually say uh, United States it is me it is it doesn't meant for uh, black people United States it means for white people yeah because majority of them who live in United States they are uh, white and also majority of white they have dominate United States so for you being a black America I know uh, you are a citizen, you have grown there, you have a citizen of Jamaica. Also, you should not send away people who are coming to visit uh, United States as a black. In fact, the black people who are coming to visit uh, United States, instead, you should be the one who trying to help them. You should try to show them the way, you should try to at least uh, educate them more about United States. But you can imagine you are a black guy and you want to send this guy back home. No, this hurt, this very hurt also, uh, it shows how, you know, uh, by you doing this, it will maybe lead to uh, people think that uh, the black Americans, they usually like that, trying to send the other black uh, back home. No, you should stop that and also, this guy also uh he said uh when the video was going to end uh that uh we should not worry because we are the it is not all the black people in america uh they are like that yeah we should not worry this is one of the rotten <laughs> people in united states the black in united states uh trying to behave like he's not uh black so guys uh, this it is not supposed to happen and uh, I feel so bad for this Jamaican guy because uh, this guy he has no problem, he hasn't done any issues but uh, you guy coming back and uh, writing a bad comment, it is very bad and uh, you guys you should know that uh, uh, also right now the majority of black Americans they are going to Jamaica, there is a video I did whereby we have a lot of uh, black people, black American going to 
Jamaica and the reason why they are going to Jamaica it is to reconnect with the African yeah they really want to be associated with Africans and also they have come and know their ancestral story and that's why they are coming to Jamaica you know Jamaica it is a uh, majority of Jamaica it is a black majority of them they are black and uh, because of them being black black and a majority of them coming to West uh, Africa they have African heritage and so many black Americans they are going to Jamaica to reconnect with African and also to know more about black uh, to know more about African uh, culture African tradition and uh, you know they will love to come back here in Africa but Africa it is so far and that's why they are preferring to go back in Jamaica so you can imagine because of right now more Africa more black American they are going to Jamaica and uh, the Jamaica started also sending uh, them to United States it will not be uh, good because Jamaicans they welcome them and they see them as uh, their brothers and sisters also and I'm being told uh, there is a lot of uh, black uh, American they have families in Jamaica a lot of them they have family in Jamaica and that's why they are usually come in large numbers uh, during a uh, holiday to get back and uh, stay with their family in Jamaica and uh, guys I don't want to go further and I hope this guy will watch this video and uh, he will recorrect his mistake and uh, as usual guys I told you I'm advocating for Jamaica I don't want to see anything bad happening to Jamaica and kindly guys uh, like this video so that uh, YouTube can spread this video to a lot of people so that uh, they can watch and also know what it is happening and also if you have not yet subscribe subscribe like and also share so thank you so much for watching this video i'll be coming more with a lot of video thank you so much